typical solid fall. Uh, a lot of it built around team building. Uh, a lot of it, you know, obviously kind of putting our system in place and, you know, what we emphasize as a coaching staff and a program here and what we'd like to see our guys strive to do and what our expectations are and, you know, uh, wanting them to try to strive to meet those expectations and them understanding, you know, we're here to coach them and to help them get better and to help them become better human beings and, you know, how to do the right thing as much as possible. Uh, and those are going to carry over as positives on the field as well as off the field. So, you know, we think we made those strides in, in reaching those goals and getting us to a point where when we come back in January, you know, we can, uh, you know, start really honing in on the things we need to do to be successful. You know, obviously a bigger group with a baseball team that's a large group uh, to kind of help lead and, and take the things that you're telling them as a team and, and letting them take ownership in it and also, you know, helping promote that and, and building a work ethic and a routine uh, of discipline that helps them get better each day and having seniors and leaders that do that in the clubhouse and when the coaches aren't around and, you know, serving as motivators other than the coach doing it all the time. And so we really focused on leadership and had a lot of meetings with you know, seniors and individuals about what we needed them to do to help us accomplish our goals. We've been also trying to work on is, uh, you know, increase our own base percentage. Last year we weren't very offensive. You know, we pitched the ball and catch the ball really well, and we're hoping we can do that again, and we think we have the, the people and the personnel in place to do that. Uh, and you need that base, you know, to really have a chance to compete for championships. But to ultimately, you know, win championships, you need to have the offense to go with it. Uh, we think we brought in some, you know, new guys that can help plug in some places there that, that can increase our offense and maybe deepen our lineup. I mean, uh, you know, we have five, six guys that were in the lineup last year to their back. The, the main guys are up through the middle of the field that, you know, we think need to be the leaders and the catalyst of the team. It starts, you know, with uh, Chase Kiefer. You know, he's a senior now and he played right field. He's played some infield. He's very versatile for us, but we're looking for him to anchor down center field. Uh, and he's going to be at the top of our order. He's an outstanding runner. Uh, you know, we want his on-base percentage to go up and set the table for us and had a very solid year last year, his best offensive year since he's been here, and we're looking for him to improve upon that. We also have Alex Green back that's a fifth-year senior. He's kind of anchored the shortstop position the last few years, and he's very good at, you know, defensively and, uh, you know, had a solid offensive year last year, looking for him to make the next step as well. And then finally, you've got Kyle Hamner behind the plate, been with us four years, and another program guy that uh, has continued to get better. We think he's one of the best catch and throw guys, you know, around. We have the three guys that were in our rotation most of the year last year, and uh, Brandon Nagum had a terrific year for us, and he'll be a senior, and we look for him to kind of lead the staff. Walker O'Connor, uh, you know, is a fourth-year guy with us as a junior, and, uh, you know, he's done a great job, and as well as Jared Petrie, uh, we may move Petrie to the bullpen to help us deepen our bullpen because we brought in some new junior college guys that we think are going to be, you know, very good for us. Uh, you know, we're looking forward to a great season. Obviously, injuries play a key role. Your seniors having great years, and you know, we think if they can fall into place and you know see how the new guys, you know, adjust to the new league, whether it's junior college or high school kids. You know, it's the four-year level. Division two is tough baseball, and I'm anxious to see how they, you know, perform under the fire. And uh, I think the team's got great chemistry at this point, and we've got to help continue that through the spring.